Hey hi everyone, in this video we will learn how to connect Kotec Neo with the Go Charting. So recently Kotec Neo has changed their login flow. So we will understand how we can connect Kotec Neo with Go Charting. For that you have to go to this broker section and here you will put your mobile number, unique client code and M pin. First of all because these three things never change. So just put these three things. So here you have to make sure that you put a plus 91 before your mobile number. A unique client code is the client ID which is given to you by Kotec Neo and M pin is the uh, pin which is set by you in your mobile app. Okay. Now we are left with two things that is TOTP and access token. So for TOTP guys, you have to go to this website. I will put the uh, link of uh, this website in the description box of this video. And here you will just put uh, your mobile number then click on proceed and here it will ask for an OTP after you enter your OTP click on verify and it will show you your client code as well here and then you have to select this register TOTP and click on continue now guys this is important now here you will see that there is a QR code okay please listen carefully here so first of all, you have to install an authenticator app in your mobile. It can be Google Authenticator or any other authenticator app. Then you have to open your authenticator app and scan this QR code. Okay. So after you scan this QR code, you will get a code in your authenticator. Okay. So let me scan it. And now I have just got a code in my Google Authenticator app and it is important many people do not follow this. You have to put this code below over here. Okay, here then only it will register. Okay, so let me put the code. Click on continue and then it will show you the message of TOTP registered successfully okay so that was important so first time you have to put that TOTP which you got in your authenticator app over here just below QR code to register successfully second thing is many people what they do is uh, they registered multiple times and they get multiple Kotec Neo uh, TOTP in their authenticator app and when you have to enter this TOTP actually in Go Charting website, then you are confused which code to put. Okay. So make sure that if you have multiple codes, you just remove all the codes from your Google Authenticator by simply, you know, uh, uh, sliding right side. So it will delete all those codes and you have only one Kotec Neo code. Okay. In your Authenticator app. So after this TOTP is registered, we can fill TOTP here. Now let's talk about access token. So if you remember earlier, we had this portal for uh, having the access token. Now they have made it very simple. This is the Kotec Neo trading portal. Here you have to click on more and then go to trade APIs. And if you see here, we already have this default application access token. Okay, you simply you have to copy this and come and paste here. So this is not changing every time. So what is changing every time is just TOTP. So you can fix all these things. You can save all these details in your uh, browser as well uh, if you want. And you can on a daily basis, you can simply uh, fill the TOTP and this will connect. So let me fill the TOTP. Click on I agree and connect. And it has started the process of connection. And you can see that the broker is connected. Okay. So this is how you can easily connect Kotec Neo with co-charting now. Thank you guys.